your Keyword Spy membership comes with a sophisticated set of tools to allow you to do complex competition research. Now maybe in your initial market research you've already determined and have a list of strong competitors that you know you'll be up against in your business. Your Keyword Spy membership will allow you to find both the strengths and weaknesses of the competition so that you can find an exact strategy as you approach the market. Let's take just a minute and walk through some of the ways you can do competition research with your Keyword Spy membership. Now first of all, you'll notice that I've put the domain of a company in that I'd like to research. And in this case, I just have this fictitious furniture company and I've identified this as one of my competitors and I need to find the strengths and weaknesses of this competitor so that I can use that to help my own business succeed. So you'll notice that Keyword Spy has pulled up a domain report for us because we selected the domain radio button and we're searching within the United States. Now one of the first things you'll do as you look at your competition research is you want to see what their daily ad budget is. And in the overview tab, you'll notice that Keyword Spy lays out for us very easily we can see the actual daily ad budget as an estimate of the domain we're searching on, in this case smartfurniture.com. Now obviously, the higher the ad budget the company has, the harder it's going to be to go up against them simply because they already have a lot of resources to work with. So the overview tab can already give you a very good idea of how strong the strength of your competition is just based simply on the ad budget. The next thing we want to look at is the ads, the pay-per-click ads for the competition that we're researching. There's a few things we want to note here. First of all, I would use the filtering features. You can click on the ROI tab and you can sort them in descending order, which is going to place the most profitable ads that this company is using at the top of the list. So in this case, we already had the IOR sorted in descending order, and we can begin to see the ads that are performing well for our competition. Also note if there's an affiliate strategy in place. We can click on this link here and we can see that no affiliates were found. Now had affiliates been found, we could have sorted by either no affiliates or just affiliates, which would have allowed us to see some of the strategies that the affiliates are using to promote our competition site. Now in this case, there's a lot of information that we can gather just from the summary here that we see on the ads tab. In this instance, we can see the keyword that was used and we can look and see how relevant the ad is to the keyword. So let's look, take a look at this second one here. We notice that the keyword here is organize my home office and we'll see that the very headline for the ad is organize my home office. So if we look at the ads and we look at the keywords that they're bidding on, we see that one of the techniques the competition is using, they have very relevant pay-per-click ads. Now you'll notice that if we look over here, we can see the position that they're bidding on. This can be very helpful as we try and target what are the most cost-effective positions in our pay-per-click advertising so that we don't spend too much or spend too little and end up not getting the clicks we need. Another thing we can do is we can look at the weaknesses of our competitor. We'll simply sort ROI in ascending order. This is going to bring the lowest performing ads to the top. And we can begin to look at the keywords and ad copy to try and find some possible reasons why these might be underperforming ads. So in this case, we see the keyword is Oak Bookcase, but Oak Bookcase is not referenced in the headline of the ad copy. Again, we'll look here, the Oak Corner Bookcase and again we'll see that there's no oak mentioned in the headline of the ad copy. It may be a small indication of why the ad is not performing well. Now it's also possible that the keyword itself is an underperforming keyword or that the ad copy itself is a poor performing ad. And one thing that Keyword Spy gives us which will really assist us in determining if either of these two is the case is the keywords button. If we click on this we're going to see all the keywords associated just with this ad and we can begin to see if any of the keywords are performing well. So we do see that here is an uh, bookcases and cabinets. That keyword is performing quite well with this ad. And we can look down through this list and we see shaker bookcases is performing well with this ad. So this tool really allows us to determine if the keyword is the issue, if the ad is the issue, or we can even say it this way, we can find keywords that do work well with this ad. And as we look down through this list of keywords, we can click on these keywords and find other competitors who have been able to take these keywords and create high ROI ads so that we can determine what keywords we might be able to use and what ads will best match those keywords. Next, we can click on the PPC keyword 
keywords tab to get an idea of the highest performing keywords that our com competition is using in their pay-per-click advertising. And to do that, we can simply come to the ROI column and we can sort in descending order. Now this is going to bring the highest performing keywords to the top of the list. Now we can see the highest performing keywords that our competition is using. We can also get an idea for the search volume, the cost per click, the number of profitable ads, the number of affiliate ads, the number of days seen, and the last and first seen. Another ability we can do is to simply decide that we only want to see keywords that are greater than or equal to, in this case I'll choose 10. So Keyword Spy is only going to return the keywords that have an ROI value greater than or equal to 10. So we see in this case we've just determined that out of the 9,966 keywords that Smart Furniture is bidding on, there are only 1,140 keywords with an ROI of 10 or greater. The next thing we can do is we can click on the Organic Keywords tab. Now in this case, we want to determine the SEO strength of our competition. So we can immediately see from this tab that there are 2,344 keywords that our competition is ranked for organically. But one feature that's very nice is the ability to sort. So we're going to click on the position and we're going to say that the position must be less than or equal to 10. So we only want to see the list of keywords where the competition is ranking in the top 10 for the keyword. So in this case we now have a list of keywords where the position is within the top 10. We can see the number of search results for that keyword. We can see an approximation of the search volume for that keyword. We can see the cost per click for that keyword and we can see the specific URL that is ranked for that keyword. Now this is extremely helpful because as we look down through the URL column we want to see how well the inner pages of the site are ranking to determine how deep the organic rankings are for the site. Now another thing we could do is we could do a site specific search on our domain to determine how many pages Google has indexed and we can reference that number to the number of organic keywords that are ranking for and looking down the URL column, we can determine how deep those rankings go. Now all of these are good indicators which will help us to determine how effective the SEO campaign of our competition is. We also have the ability to find additional competitors simply based on the domain we entered and we can see the subdomains for our competition. Now all of these tools are very helpful and if you're doing any type of competition research, your Keyword Spy membership is invaluable. You're going to be able to determine how effective the ads of your competition are, what keywords are the highest performing keywords that your competition is using, how effective the organic SEO ranking strategy is of your competition, and you'll even get an idea before you do any investment in your own company of how much your competition has to spend on pay-per-click advertising. All of these indicators can tell you exactly who are the top competitors, who you should be concerned about, and you can find the strengths and weakness of your competition so that you can take your own company to a whole new level.